This week on Turning Tuesday, I prepared some blanks for requested order. In one of my previous videos, I turned something I called Unknown Species. I have since confirmed that that species is Spotted Gum. It comes up beautiful, it is extremely dense, and it's got some beautiful sharp orange and brown undertones. The other blanks that I had working here were Edge of Sapwood on the black butt so it's beautiful yellows and browns and it should go through the center with sap inclusion as you may have just heard there was quite bad vibration coming from the tail stock i tried to fix that at certain points however in some of the clips i've just turned the volume right down i'm not entirely sure what was causing this i suspect it was the blank was off center um because you'll notice the drill bit goes a bit crazy there as well um, nothing about this lathe actually lines up it's not accurate it's not fantastic it does the job though because as you'll notice, some of my pens come out absolutely gorgeous. These are never perfectly square, so finding the center is never going to work properly. So what I do instead is I let it spin because with the end grain, you can see a tiny little circle in the center. And I then try and let the tip of the drill bit try and find the absolute center. And most of the time it comes out pretty close. Some of the time it comes out nowhere near. I've never gone through the side though, so I've been pretty lucky. saving grace with this is the second part preparing the blanks is when you're barrel trimming so you're taking the edge of the wood down to the edge of the brass you'll notice i'm inserting the brass in the next set of clips i mount them in with epoxy and yeah that's how i end up getting square because the end of these are never going to be square So preparing my workstation to epoxy the brass barrels in. When I buy these brass barrels, I buy them in bulk so that I can throw them on the lathe and I sand them so that I can just grab them and go. So I just grab the number I needed for the blanks that I had. And yeah, so 
in these blanks i've got them paired up because it is a top and a bottom i do plan on making some pencils as well as some standard streamline or the nice broad pens that i make typically so the four pen blanks up above or the eight halves are the spotted gum and the ones below with the sap inclusion are black butt this is going to be quite an interesting set of pens i believe those black butts have really strong bright and dark undertones so it should come out absolutely gorgeous i believe i'm going to do a set of light and dark with the black butt i think i'll do a pen and a pencil and have them as a matching pair i think that'll go really well for someone as a gift i'm wearing full respirator as well as nitrile gloves so the epoxy can't see through epoxy is quite toxic and i don't want any reactions safety first anyway thanks for watching i really appreciate it